Okay, let's start by importing the code. And actually, let me close this. In session 14, I'm going to create a new class, which is called rectangle example. And I'm going to copy everything from second line all the way to the end. And to avoid confusion, I'm going to close this previous one. <clears throat> so this is the new rectangle example that we just created. <clears throat> and if I launch it now, you will see it, see the change. And remember we said we want to change that to yellow. So let me change this to yellow and maybe change the starting point to to x to 30 which means it will move right starting at right and set y to 50 it will move right and uh, down and then set the height to how about 30 it will be a relatively wide one so that's you can see starting it was here and it moves left, uh, right, and down, and it becomes white, and the color becomes yellow. And you can play more with this, but, uh, and you can even introduce, try to introduce a circle or square or triangle. But the, the uh, fundamental idea is the same. You have a component, either it's a rectangle or a circle or whatever, then you will set its position, its color fill, and the width, and, uh, whatever component, if it's a circle, certainly you will set the radius. Then you will add this component to the root, which is a group. And group will go into scene, scene will go to in the stage. And stage being a object created by Java FX, you will be able to see whatever is shown here, it got displayed. And by the way, this is a very important te uh, technology that once you define something as the class, then you can add the same class into their framework. Okay, so this is the first question and the second question. <clears throat> 